Friends, all of these logos you're looking at was not designed by a graphic designer. They were all designed by AI. And in this video, I'm going to be teaching you as well how you can use this awesome AI tool to design professional logos without even having any idea about designing. Are you excited already? So am I. Let's jump right into the video. The AI tool we are going to be using is Bing Chart. You can also use Bing um, Image, but because of I want it to be in a conversational way, so I'm going to be using Bing Chart. All right. Now, when you open your Bing Chart, all right, and then you're going to select the creative conversation style. All right. Then I'm going to say, give me logo ideas for a hair salon business. I want to open. Describe each idea as precise as possible. Okay, so I'm going to send this and wait for it. So now you're going to give it whether your whichever brand that you want to be in. So you can just change it to that brand. Okay. So we said here are some logo ideas for your hair salon business. It said a pair of scissors cutting a strand of hair that forms the letter s of the word salon all right a silhouette of a woman's head with flowing hair and the name of your business curved around it okay then a circular logo with a barber pole in the center and the name of your business around the edge so the next was a simple test logo with the name of your business in a coily font and a okay this one says a stylized comb and brush forming a cross with the name of your business written okay so i'm going to copy this one and come here then i'm going to write create a logo then i'm going to add a pair of scissors cutting a strand of hair that forms the letter s of the word salon okay then i'm going to write um simple logo then I'm going to add SVG. Then I'm going to add white background. Okay. All right. Let's see what it gives us. Oh, wow. This is nice. I think this is nice, guys. This is really nice. This is really nice. Okay. So which one will it be for you? I think the first one is quite cool. The second one is also quite nice, you know, like it's trying to write S with scissors. Okay, so let's write, make the S bigger in the second logo. Okay, you can see that this is actually powered by OpenAI's DAL-E. All right, so this is the second one I've chosen. Okay, this is actually the second one I've chosen. So you made the S bigger in the second one all right so whichever one but this one is already catching my attention though to so, all this one also right this is also quite nice so whichever one you choose all right all you need to do is to select that one take it to probably canva then add the name of your brand underneath it and yola you have a logo so the more specific you are with the description all right that you give to Bing Shot, the much better logo that is going to design for you. So you can jump on this also and try to design your own brand logo or design brand logos for other businesses using AI. A lot of people believe that the um, coming of AIs are posing as a risk to people's jobs. As much as there is some sincerity or truth in that statement that a lot of people might might lose their job because of ai i would also like to say that a lot of people are going to get jobs because of ai now if you do not want ai to replace you i think what you should be looking at doing instead of fighting the evolution of ai is learning how you can leverage ai for instance as a graphic designer you should know that not everybody might want to now wait the longer period of time that it might take you to deliver on a job 
all right so instead you might want to use ai to make your work more seamless and also increase your productivity and even if you're not a graphic designer and you want to use the tutorial that i'll talk about you also still need a basic concept of design so that you get to know if the colors you're using the you know the ai is releasing is the appropriate colors and also the interpretation of those colors and images okay or shapes or symbols on that um logo that you're generating all right i hope this was helpful i created a recent video where i reviewed the best keyboard in 2023 i'm going to link it over here and you can also check out this playlist if you would want to see more tutorials that you can try out on your smartphone and if this video you're being recommended for here is a video you wouldn't want to miss do watch it and if you are yet to subscribe hit this button up here to subscribe to my channel with this thanks for watching i'll see you on the next one